Hi, my name is Karen, and I decided to do my presentation on designer HR Giger. Asia Giger is an artist of fantasy and realistic. He's a, he's a Swedish painter, sculptor, and set designer. His first piece were mostly ink drawings and oil paintings. His first worldwide published poster was by H.H. Connor Company in 1969. Then he discovered the airbrush. His first book, Necromancy, was published in 1977. He was also part of a special effects team for the movie Alien, which he won an Oscar in 1980. He also did sculptures in 3D environments. He also um, did a the sun our environment in Tokyo, Japan in 1988. In 2013, he was admitted to the Science Fiction and Fantasy Hall. Here are some of Gilbert's um, paintings. He was really into aliens. He had a lot of nightmares, alien nightmares, that inspired him to do his paintings. Uh, of aliens and some um, uh, interconnected relationship art um, paintings, which I find very interesting, by the way. Um, some of his extra work besides painting was the film Alien vs. Predators, as we are all are familiar with that film. He also did an album cover for a band called um brain cell surgery he also did a video game called dark seed he was born in a town named search switzerland in february 5 1940 he was born um his father wanted him to follow his footsteps of being a pharmacist but that wasn't his dream his dream was to be an artist. In 1962, he moved to Zurich to study architecture and in industrial design at the School of Applied Arts until 1970. Gibbard has his own museum. In June 1966, he bought Satan German Castle, which is his home and his museum. He has over 2,000 of his paintings, and his, um, as you see, his museum and his home was based on all of his work, his alien work, which is really interesting. He had a very unique style. He did um, ink drawings, then he moved to oil painting, then mostly did airbrush, pastel, and markers. He's, um, he got inspired by the human body and mechanic, mechanics in a cold and interconnected relationships. One of, it, one of the persons he was influenced by was by um, Dado. He was a famous painter. Also, by Ernest Bunch, he was an Australian painter. Salvador Deli was a Spanish painter. These three people influenced him on being who he is, a painter. He didn't all his work was all about painting. He also had a personal life. In 1966, he met the artist and muse Lee, Lee Tober. But unfortunately, in 1975, she committed suicide. And by that, um, he decided to use uh, some of his painting expired by his ex-girlfriend, Lee Tabber. Um, in 1976, he married Mia Bonsango. But unfortunately, 
they got divorced one and a half year. On Monday, May 12, 2014, sadly, he died by falling down stairs. And that was the end of Gertrude's um, career, which I really um, like his style. Uh, when I first started to do this research, I looked at his paintings and I thought um, they were fascinating, a bit disturbing. Um, by the way he painted using the human body um, and, but I mean I really thought it was interesting and that's why I decided to make my presentation about him. I hope you learn uh, a lot of things about H.R. Um, Giver in this presentation. Thank you for watching.